and box good story for them the best that I can. Mama Shakira, she's this pure white tiger. And Bosco, he's the white tiger with the black stripes. So these two, they were also rescued from Colorado in 2016. Unfortunately, this facility was breeding their animals and they were supplying cubs for the cub petting industry. This is where things start to get sad. So what the cub petting industry is, this is where people will go to a facility and they will pay to take pictures with cubs, uh, maybe to bottle feed cubs. Some facilities let you swim with cubs. There's all sorts of pay to play experiences out there. But what a lot of people don't know is that this is actually really detrimental to the life of this cub. When cubs are being cub pet, they're stripped away from mama immediately after birth. In the wild, they're supposed to stay with her for upwards of two years. Once they're stripped away from her, they're then bottle fed. Because these people, they want the cubs to bond with humans, not mama. So they're missing out on all the nutrition that they need from mother's milk. Imagine taking an infant to Walmart. Imagine passing it around for eight hours a day, seven days a week. Think of how sick this baby could become. The same exact thing happens to these cubs. They can become very, very ill. They can actually get what's called metabolic bone disease. And what this means is that their bones are so weak and brittle from malnourishment and from being handled so often that they could more or less break in your hands as you're handling them. And guys, quick side note, I have never seen Mama Shakira <laughs> that was the first time I've ever seen her creep up on him like that. That was really cool. <laughs> uh, so, cubs within the cub petting industry. Well, first, I'm going to tell you the story of Mama Shakira and Bob.